In this tutorial, I will show you how to use Math Seeds on your computer. Simply go to MathSeeds.com and click on the login link at the top of the page. On the login link, you're going to enter the username and password that the school provided to you. You can click on Remember Me if you don't want your student to have to type it in every time, and then Let Me In. You'll notice that when I log into Reading Eggs here, I can also access Reading, or I'm sorry, when I log into Math Seeds, I can also access Reading Eggs if that's assigned to you, and Reading Express if that is assigned to you. So for Math Seeds, I'm going to click on Enter, go into the Math Seeds program, and the first time you go into it, it's going to give you a test. So if you click on Lesson 1, It will ask you if you have any math skills whatsoever. If no math skills exist with a student and you want to just start at the very beginning of the program, you can click on Do Not Do the Test. If you have some math skills and want to start at the right level, which is uh, what I suggest and recommend, then you'll click on Do the Test. There will be a series of questions, and as soon as you miss two or three questions, the test will stop, and then it will know where to place you. So as you get the questions correct, We'll keep track of your correct answers. And then as you miss questions, you'll see it keeps track of the number of questions that you have missed. And in this case, when I miss two, it stops the test and it places you in the correct map. The more questions you get correct, the further into Math Seeds program you'll be placed. So this instance, we're starting on map one. You can simply click on Let's Go. And then I click on the number one to open up that world, and it's going to begin my lessons. Over here at the top left-hand side of the screen, you'll see a little arrow that will pull up your dashboard. And you'll see that in this case, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 lessons in the first world of the map. And you go through them sequentially. You can see that they have a lock on them until you complete them. And as you successfully complete each lesson, you'll be allowed to move on to the following lesson. If I go home, it brings me back to my dashboard. Up here you see some golden acorns. As you do well in the program and complete tasks, you'll get acorns and then you can spend those on different things with playing and shopping in the Math Seeds program where you can decorate some of your features. Uh, you have your awards, you have driving tests, which are going to be on numbers, operations, patterns, measurements, geometry, and so forth. You have a number of tests that you can take, and then that will track how well you're progressing and moving through your math uh, facts as well. So this is basically how you play Math Seeds. You can explore different links on your dashboard. This is the treehouse. And this is where you can change the character. Give him different arms, different body and hats, and as you get more points you'll be able to change his other features, belts, dresses, jackets, and so forth. So the more you do in Math Seeds, the more options that you have in the arcade and the shopping and different things like that. So you can see to play these games it costs 10 acorns and again you earn acorns back here in your lessons by completing more lessons and doing well. Your awards will show you certificates that you've earned as you finish maps and this is a playhouse where you can click on different features and play games. Everything will be math based. I'm going to click on the home. And this is, uh, this is how you complete your math seeds on the computer. You can log out by clicking on buy. And if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to call or email us.